from science to the arts and everywhere in between. People are opening up new worlds with the Power Mac G4. I feel like one of the apes in 2001. It's the monolith. The new Power Mac G4 is going to revolutionize our business. It's not going to change it, it's going to revolutionize it. This is a significant development. This is going to be a really huge breakthrough for a huge industry. Now there's a new Power Mac G4, a super high performance personal computer with the power to create, the power to burn, the power to perform like never before. It's just amazingly fast. <laughs> I think that's incredible. I think the speed, it, that kind of boost is phenomenal. We're still reeling from the 733, so I walk in there and it's like, okay, the 733 is now our admin machine. <laughs> it's amazing. Apple SuperDrive has added an exciting new dimension to the G4 line. Complex tasks that used to take whole groups of people can now be done with one person on one machine, the new Power Mac G4. Now I'm so excited because I'm talking with some of our artists about making their own videos. Apple is giving them the power, is actually giving them the power to follow through with their artistic vision, which is after all the reason that we signed them, and they can fulfill it. Apple's making that possible for them, and it's the greatest thing in the world. The new Power Mac G4 lineup is screaming fast. It starts with a 733 megahertz G4 chip or you can step right up to 867 megahertz with a 2 megabyte L3 cache, the fastest chip we've ever shipped. At the high end, there's the new bad dog, the dual 800 megahertz G4, the fastest Mac we've ever made. The modern foundation under Mac OS X takes full advantage of the dual processors, boosting productivity even further with symmetric multiprocessing. The new 867 megahertz system runs Photoshop 50% faster than the latest 1.7 gigahertz Intel system. And with dual 800s, we are running over 80% faster. That's speed you can see, speed you can use. There are four PCI slots for expansion, an NVIDIA card standard across the line. The new Power Mac G4 and our family of all digital displays are opening up whole new worlds of possibilities. There are six billion bases in the human genome. That corresponds to an information content of 750 megabytes. The data are immense, and in order to think about them, we have to be able to manipulate them. And in order to manipulate 750 megabyte chunks of information, you need very big and fast computers. And for that reason, the G4 caught our attention because it represents another iteration of revolutionary change uh, from the server to the desktop. When you take something like the G4 and you put dual processors running at 800, that's like twin turbos in our business. J. Walter Thompson is, is an idea engine, and the Apple uh, Power Mac G4s with their super drives and allow us to, to burn DVDs. And when you're able to burn DVDs real time, that's one less thing you have to wait for. And the less waiting time, the more time you have to uh, be creative. I've never found an artist who has a problem when I talk to them about Macintosh. They always understand. Digital recording tools, you go to Apple. That's it. CD mastering solutions, Apple. Album graphics, Apple. I don't, I've never met anyone who uses anything but Apple. Everyone in this company does. It's all about Apple. Hallmark isn't just about greeting cards anymore. You see tools like IDVD being priceless in that any designer within Hallmark can sit down and build a montage, a marketing theme, and it inspires me because it will allow them to be the creative geniuses that they are. Oh my God. As soon as people see this keynote and they're watching, you know, uh, they'll be lining up outside my office saying, when are these going to arrive?